Hello everyone, welcome to the ZStream, it's Henry here. Today I have another tutorial for you in the How to Mod Minecraft series. Today I'm going to be showing you how to add new recipes into the furnace. First of all, let me just quickly say, if you have no idea what I'm talking about, and if you have no idea how to mod, go back to part one. Um, this is uh, a part in an entire series made by the ZStream on how to mod Minecraft. So if you're confused right now, just go back to part one and and it'll clear things up hopefully anyway to add your own furnace recipe what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna open up edit rocket I assume you know what you're doing cuz uh, if you're still here you probably watched part one or something like that you're gonna open up edit rocket and the class we're looking for is called furnace recipes oddly enough so here it is I found it it's called furnace recipes Java and it's not very big but right here this big block here that those are all the recipes that you can put in a furnace those are basically all the blocks you can put in a furnace to get something out of it there's not that many one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven eleven i think if i counted properly so all we have to do this is much like adding a crafting manager recipe it's literally just one line i like to put a comment and just write added recipes and then what we're going to type is we're just going to copy the same as what's written up here. That's the same, it's the same template. So we're going to write add smelting bracket block dot. And here you write what block you want to put into, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. And first here you put in what block you want to put into the furnace. So we're going to say like block dot dirt. You'll notice I use dirt a lot in my tutorials. It's because there's a lot of it and it's easy to get. Uh, you could put any block though or any item for that matter. Um, so we're going to say block dot dirt dot block ID. I think if you put in if you put in an item such as uh, raw pork or raw fish or clay, you have to write dot shifted index instead. Any item you have to write dot shifted index after it. If you use a block, you have to write dot block id after it. Okay, and then we're gonna type in comma new item stack. This is all the same as what's written above. And then here you write what it's going to give out. So we're gonna say uh, item dot diamond sure um, and then here are two numbers I don't believe I know what those numbers are for um, here we have we'll just look at this exemplar and smelting block dot iron so basically if you put one piece of iron ore in it creates a new item stack and it gives you item dot iron ingot so we just want item dot diamond. So maybe we'll just put that. Two brackets and a comma to end it. Save. And you know the drill. We'll open up Finder. Go to MCP. Make this smaller. Um, oh, I don't have terminal open here. Terminal. Open terminal. CD. Uh, link this MCP folder. And we're going to bash, bash the recompiler, press enter, compiling Minecraft. All right, it's compiling, go, 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 go. <laughs> Random noises here. I don't know, man. I'm an odd guy. Okay, I'm getting off topic again. Anyway, bash. Test game. Okay, so it's open Minecraft. We're going to go to single player. New world. What did he just... Oh, man. Oh, man. I just realized this is a furnace recipe. That means I have to go get a furnace. Which means I have to make a pickaxe. Oh, okay, don't worry. I'll fast forward through this for you guys. Ooh. Oh my god, that pisses me off. Okay. 
I just wasted some time. I hate wasting time. Um, I actually... Oh, I'm stuck in a hole. Wasting more time. Stuck in a hole. Okay, I actually realized that uh, I blew this big hole up already before. So I didn't actually have to make a pickaxe. Wow. Just wasted like 30 seconds of my life. Anyway, I'm just going to walk around and pick up some of these pieces of cobblestone that I blasted out of the ground in a previous episode. Uh, swim back to the top. And we're going to make a furnace. Oh, I still need one block of log to power my furnace. Alright. So, this is what we're going to do. Make a furnace. Okay. I have my furnace. Now, I'm going to put in my piece of wood. Here, watch this magic. I'm going to put in my dirt, and we know it's already worked because it accepted it. The arrow is loading. All the suspense. Oh my god, it's killing me. My heart rate's going up. Oh my god, look at that. I have a diamond. Wow. I must be a good businessman. Oh, damn. Profit, here I come. Anyway, that proves that it works. Um, I hope... That was useful for you guys. I say that like every time, don't I? Anyway, I hope you liked this video. If you did like the video, you know what you should do? You should press like because the like button means that you like the video. What do you know? And if you like our tutorials, the Z Streams tutorials, uh, please subscribe. I'm going to come out with a whole bunch more. I say that every time too, but it's true. I'm coming out with more and more every day. So if you want to continue to learn how to mod Minecraft, subscribe and watch our videos. Also, if you have a question for me or if you have a mod that you'd like me to demonstrate, you can write it in the comment section below and I will see what I can do about it. Maybe I'll make a tutorial. Anyways, thanks for watching guys and I'll see you next time.